two very interesting things happening on the stimulus front. On the one hand, the Build Back Better plan looks dead in the water at this hour. But there's a new round of stimulus checks being floated because of Omicron and inflation. So we're getting reports this morning from Bloomberg that members of Congress are considering a new bill that would send direct stimulus checks to the American people. We're talking $2,000 to be exact. This echoes a huge change.org p- petition from a Colorado restaurant owner, which has, uh, I think, millions of, of uh, signatures at this point, uh, who's been hard hit. Uh, the nearly two year long pandemic has crushed restaurants um, now whose businesses have been hardest hit by the nearly two two year long pandemic. A lot of these people have signed this petition and Congress has taken notice of it. So also the Senior Citizens League this morning also asking Congress, they said they've received just so many letters from retirees who just can't make ends meet. They're calling for direct payments for Social Security recipients. So Democrats reportedly putting together a bill that would be highly targeted with a singular focus on stimulus checks. But I got to say, I will believe it when I see it, because right now the Build Back Better stimulus appears to be dead in the water. And that includes that thirty six hundred dollar child tax credit. I mean, they're all pointing to inflation. Right. So the, the, the issue here is inflation and Omicron because of high inflation, excuse me, high inflation right now and Omicron, and obviously people, uh, businesses closing back down again. Um, Could they send out these $3,600 child tax credit checks to American families? It doesn't look like that's going to happen. Overnight, Joe Manchin all but confirmed that he is not supporting the Build Back Better stimulus over his concerns around inflation. That means um, any vote on the bill will likely slip into 2022 when the coming midterm elections will only heighten the sharp political pressure surrounding this plan. Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer yesterday said his party will, quote, continue working on getting the Senate into a position where we can vote on the president's Build Back Better legislation. He did not mention his goal of approving the plan by Christmas, which is a target date that he has repeated for weeks. And then asked Wednesday if he believes the bill can pass this year. President Biden said, I hope so, but it's going to be close. Failure to uh, pass the plan in 2021 will have immediate impacts. I mean, because think about it, guys. The enhanced child tax credit right now is that $300 per month child tax credit. It's going to expire at the end of this year. That means the last payment went out on Wednesday, basically, two days ago. Uh, And the Build Back Better Act would actually renew these things for uh, an entire year at least. There are a lot of progressives, of course, that have been pushing for that to go uh, even further than a one year, making it permanent. But right now, those things have dried up. So that is a look at your stimulus. Um, do you think that we will actually see a $2,000 stimulus check separate from a Build Back Better plan? Again, Democrats putting this bill together. Again, I will believe it when I see it, but I'll wait for a bill and see if there's any appetite for it. President Biden seems to be pushing this Omicron um, winter of death pretty hard. So maybe they will try to push another round of stimulus through to raise his approval rating because those things seem to work.